Ever found yourself daydreaming about strolling through Parisian streets, baguette in hand, only to be jolted back to reality by your bank account balance? Fear not, intrepid traveller, for Europe doesn't have to remain a distant fantasy. It's entirely possible to explore this magnificent continent without breaking the bank, even if your budget's closer to student backpacker than luxury yacht owner. I've had my fair share of budget travel experiences. I once spent a week in Switzerland surviving mainly on cheese and chocolate. It wasn't pretty, but it was an adventure. The truth is, traveling on a budget isn't about sacrificing the experience. It's about being resourceful, adaptable, and open to the unexpected. It's about swapping fancy hotels for cozy hostels, Michelin-starred restaurants for bustling local markets, and first-class flights for scenic train journeys. Trust me, the memories you create will be worth every penny saved. So loosen your purse strings just a little, pack your sense of adventure, and get ready to discover the joys of budget travel in Europe. Before we delve into the nitty-gritty of budget travel tips, let's establish a fundamental truth. You don't need to be rich to travel, you just need to be clever. It's all about prioritizing experiences over extravagance. Do you really need that five-star hotel with a butler named Jeeves, or would you rather spend your money on exploring ancient ruins and sampling local delicacies? Embrace the art of frugality, pack light, avoid tourist traps, and remember, haggling is not a crime, it's an art form. Traveling on a budget isn't about deprivation, it's about liberation. Liberation from the shackles of consumerism, liberation from the fear of missing out, and liberation from the miscon... Ah, uh, the age-old question, to fly or not to fly? Well, when it comes to budget travel in Europe, the answer is often a resounding it depends. Budget airlines can be your best friend or your worst enemy. Yes, those rock-bottom prices are tempting, but beware of hidden fees for everything from baggage to oxygen. Always read the fine print and pack light, my friend, pack light. But wait, there's more. Europe is a wonderland of alternative transportation options. Trains offer scenic journeys through rolling hills and charming villages. Buses are a cost-effective way to cover long distances, and cycling allows you to experience the continent at your own pace. And don't forget about ride-sharing platforms. They can be a surprisingly affordable way to travel between cities, especially if you're traveling in a group. So, ditch the air miles obsession and embrace now, let's talk about accommodation. If you're picturing luxurious hotel suites with private balconies and swan-shaped towels, you might want to skip ahead. But if you're open to a more communal experience, hostels are where it's at. Forget the horror stories you've heard about snoring roommates and questionable hygiene. Hostels have come a long way, baby. Many offer private rooms with ensuite bathrooms, and even the dorm rooms are generally clean, safe, and surprisingly comfortable. But the true beauty of hostels lies in their social atmosphere. You'll meet fellow travellers from all walks of life, swap stories, share travel tips, and maybe even make lifelong friends. And hey, if hostels aren't your cup of tea, don't despair. Consider couch surfing, Airbnb, or even house sitting for a truly local experience. Remember, it's not about the thread count of your sheets, it's about the memories you create. Eat like a local, spend like a pauper, food and drink on a budget. Let's be honest, one of the best parts of traveling is indulging in the local cuisine. But gourmet restaurants can quickly drain your budget faster than a leaky faucet. Fear not, fellow foodie, for there are plenty of ways to tantalize your taste buds without emptying your wallet. Embrace the street food scene. From sizzling chorizo rolls in Spain to steaming bowls of pho in Vietnam, Street food offers an authentic taste of local culture at a fraction of the price. Plus, it's a great way to mingle with the locals and practice your, hopefully, another tip cook your own meals whenever possible. Hostels and Airbnb rentals often have kitchens and even a simple pasta dish can feel like a gourmet feast after a long day of sightseeing. And when it comes to drinks, well, let's just say that sticking to local beers and wines is not only budget friendly, but also a great way to support local businesses Cheers to that! Free as a bird, free activities and attractions. Who says you need to spend money to have fun? Europe is brimming with free activities and attractions, from world-class museums to sprawling parks and gardens. Many museums offer free admission on certain days of the week or during off-peak hours. So plan accordingly, and don't underestimate the simple pleasures of exploring a new city on foot. 
get lost in winding cobblestone streets, stumble upon hidden courtyards, and soak up the local atmosphere. You'll be surprised at what treasures you can discover without spending a dime. Oh, and speaking of free, did someone say free walking tours? Many cities offer free walking tours led by knowledgeable locals who are eager to share their city's history, culture, and hidden gems. Just be sure to tip your guide generously as they rely on tips for their livelihood. The Art of the Haggle and Other Money-Saving Secrets Now let's talk about the art of the haggle. I know, I know, some of you may find it intimidating, but trust me, it's all part of the fun. Haggling is a way of life in many parts of the world, and it's perfectly acceptable to negotiate prices, especially at markets and souvenir shops. Be polite, be respectful, and don't be afraid to walk away if you're not happy with the price. You'll be surprised at how often the vendor will chase after you with a better offer. And here's a little secret. Sometimes all you need to do is ask for a discount. Seriously, it's that simple. The worst they can say is no, and you might just end up saving yourself a few euros. Other money-saving secrets include packing a reusable water bottle, taking advantage of free Wi-Fi hotspots, and learning a few basic phrases in the local language. Travel hacking for beginners. Making technology work for you. In this digital age, technology can be your best friend when it comes to budget travel. There are countless apps and websites designed to help you save money on everything from flights and accommodation to food and activities. Use flight comparison websites like Skyscanner or Google Flights to find the cheapest airfare deals and sign up for email alerts to be notified of price drops. Accommodation booking platforms like Booking.com and Hostelworld offer a wide range of options to suit every budget, and you can often find great deals by booking in advance or traveling during the off-season. And don't forget about travel blogs and forums where fellow budget travellers share their tips, tricks and recommendations. The internet is a treasure trove of information, so use it to your advantage. Embrace the unexpected, the joys of serendipity. Now, I know what you're thinking. Budget travel sounds great, but what about spontaneity? Don't worry, my friend. Travelling on a budget doesn't mean sacrificing flexibility. In fact, it often leads to the most memorable experiences. Embrace the unexpected detours, the chance encounters, and the serendipitous moments that make travel so magical. Be open to trying new things, meeting new people, and stepping outside of your comfort zone. Some of my most cherished travel memories involve getting hopelessly lost in a foreign city, stumbling upon a hidden gem of a restaurant, or striking up a conversation with a local who shared their culture and stories with me. These are the moments that truly enrich our lives. The world is your oyster, now go find the pearls. So, there you have it, my friend. A whirlwind tour of budget travel tips and tricks to help you conquer Europe without breaking the bank. Remember, traveling on a budget is not about deprivation, it's about liberation. It's about prioritizing experiences over extravagance, embracing the unexpected, and creating memories that will last a lifetime. The world is your oyster, so go forth, explore, and most importantly, have fun. And hey, don't be shy. Share your own budget, travel tips, and experiences in the comments below, and like and subscribe. Let's inspire each other to travel more, spend less, and make the most of this incredible journey we call life. Happy travels.